Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to do a do-it-yourself face scrub um, and this is a lemon and sugar scrub. Um, I know there are lemon and salt scrubs too but um, the lemon and sugar scrub is more for people that have sensitive skin so if you do not have sensitive skin then opt for the salt scrub but I will show you that in a different video. I would even make a tutorial for it but today I'm going to do the lemon and sugar scrub only um so yeah let's just get started okay I'm gonna tell you the things that you need first you're gonna need a cup of warm water so I have a measuring cup it doesn't matter how much you have in here because you're just gonna dip a towel into here anyway so I just heated it up so it's warm and you're also going to need a clean um, washcloth so I just have a clean washcloth you're going to need a lemon you could use organic lemon juice but I prefer the fresh lemons and you're only gonna need half of that um, you're gonna need organic pure cane sugar so it looks like this and this is just by Domino's and I picked this up from my um, organic section in um, ShopRite and you're going to need some, some cotton pads, so I just have a few cotton pads. You could use the large one as well, but I only have these small ones. Um, you're going to need a bowl to mix everything in, a knife, and a spoon. If you are young, please do not use the knife. Have an adult cut your lemon for you. I don't want anyone telling me they cut a finger off or something. It's just crazy. Just use caution when you're using your knife, please, and have an adult do it for you if you are young. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. I'm going to take my lemon, and I'm just going to cut that in half. Hopefully the lemon doesn't squirt in my eye. Alright, so I cut, I cut my lemon in half. <sighs> and this smells so good. And the good thing about lemons is it takes all the bacteria out of your skin um it if you have spots on your face it lightens the space so it evens your skin tone it helps with um any blemishes it helps clear your breakouts it's really good for acne so that's why i like to use it so i'm just going to squeeze it into the bowl and if you get any seeds in there just pick them out Alright, that should be good. So I have enough lemon juice. You need about that much. And I'm just going to set that aside. And I got a seed in there, so I'm just going to pick it out. Alright, now I'm going to take my sugar. And it says pure cane right on top. I'm going to take the sugar. And I'm going to take my spoon and just get out a few spoons of the sugar and put it into my bowl so you're going to want to create a type of paste so make sure you use enough sugar so I put two in there right now and it's still liquidy so I'm just going to use some more and the sugar the granules of the sugar is going to help it's getting better now it's going to help um get all that dead skin off your face and it's going to promote um, new skin growth and give you that natural glow and everything. So it's really good for your skin. The, the salt is going to um, really, really exfoliate more than the sugar because the granules are a little sharper on the edges. So that's why it's not really good for people to have sensitive skin. Um, if you don't have sensitive skin, you could use that and it, it will exfoliate you even more and you probably won't have a problem with it. And that one actually gets the toxins out of your face as well. You could even go a little crazy and throw a little bit of sea salt in your sugar scrub too but I'm just going to leave it alone for today. So I'm just going to use the organic sugar one and then scrub away. Okay, so I put that to the side. Now it's, it's still a little liquidy, but it's less liquidy than it was before. The sugar does start to dissolve in the scrub. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my washcloth and I'm just going to dip it into that cup of the water. Now 
Now I just drained it out and I'm going to put this on my face for like 30 seconds or so just to open up all of my pores. And if I didn't say before, I did wash my face before I did this. <sighs> okay. And so now I'm going to take my little cotton pad and I'm going to dip it into the mixture and I'm going to, you might want to put this under, you might want to put a towel on your chest as well. And I'm just going to start to scrub my face in circular motions. And if you feel like the lemon is stinging you, then you could add a little bit of water to your mixture. It smells so good. And this is really good for getting rid of blackheads. I'm just going to get a new cotton pad. And I'm going to dip it in there. And I'm going to start to do my forehead. Do not get this in your eye. And I'm just using on top of my eyebrows because I don't have any eyebrow hair anyway. You won't want to do it if you have eyebrow hair on there. So just go around your eyebrows. Taking my last one. I'm just going to go around the face once again. And I'm going to use it on my lips as well. It tastes so good. <laughs> okay. So I'm just going to let this sit on my face for about five minutes. And then I'm going to rinse it off with warm water. And then I am going to rinse it off. I'm, I'm going to put cold water on my face to close all of the pores that I opened up with the, with the warm towel. So I will be back. Okay guys, so I am back and I cleaned off my face. Well, I cleaned off my face with warm water and then I closed all my pores with cold water. And my face is so smooth right now. It feels like a baby's butt. <laughs> it's really, really smooth. And all of the dead skin that I had on my cheeks and everything is gone and my lips feel incredibly soft. I'm just gonna put on my Vaseline. Um, lip therapy and and I'm also going to put on my lotion so I'm just using my Olay active hydrating uh, beauty fluid lotion my face just looks radiant so this scrub is good to do on yourself once a week you could go two times a week but that's kind of pushing it a little bit just do the one time a week give yourself um time for your your skin to you know to calm down from all the scrubbing so do it uh once a week and you should be good to go and you have a youthful glow you will tone your skin with the lemon you would help your breakouts it's really good for acne um yeah it's just it's a great scrub i like doing do-it-yourself scrubs rather than buying the scrubs in the store because you never know what kind of crazy chemicals they're putting in it that's actually making your skin worse so it's best to opt for do-it-yourself scrubs and use organic products so I like this because it only has two ingredients it has the lemon and it has the organic sugar which is really good or you could use the lemon and the sea salt which is a little coarser um, it's more for people who don't have sensitive skin but yeah this is organic as well so it's great to use organic products so I hope you guys enjoyed this do-it-yourself um, facial scrub and if you have not already please subscribe to my channel and give this video a big fat thumbs up if you enjoyed it Bye.